This was a terrible idea. Why would going to some stupid party ever be good for me? There isn't a single person here who I don't hate. Oh yeah, I'll totally come out and dance with you. I definitely don't have anything better to do. Let me go get another drink. Okay, you know what sounds good. Some alone time. Let's see. There, balcony. All to myself. Much better. Some nice solitary time. Oh, hey. Oh. Agreed. It's you. Who invited you to this party? And you actually came? God, how stupid are you? You know he just invited you so that he can make fun of you, right? Well, of course he's not actually going to invite a loser like you, let alone your friends. He actually told you that? God, what a jerk. Oh no, I still think you're an idiot for coming. I mean, guys like that don't go from pushing you around and slapping stuff on your hands to being your best friend overnight. Well, if it sounded sincere, maybe you should just do everything that any random person tells you. Surely they could never be lying or manipulating you. God, you're an idiot. Yes, how observant of you. I do call you an idiot a lot. You wanna know why? Because you come to parties thrown by people who pick on you all day. And managed to convince yourself that they actually wanted you there. Why are you even here still anyway? What do you mean you don't feel like walking? Like, back through the party to your car? <sighs> fine, fine. But if you ever, ever talk to anyone about this, I will hunt you down. Your car isn't working right now, and the nearest bus stop is 10 minutes away. So, I'm taking you back to your place. It's dark, cold, and late at night. I don't need you getting lost and freezing to death on my conscience. It's not like I actually care about you. I just need to leave this stupid party, and you need a ride home. Just come with me already. God, I'm trying to be nice for a change. Would you please just accept the help? Thank you. What? Yeah, I know you didn't give me your address. I still have it from the time that we got paired up for that project. Oh yeah, I was totally just waiting for the right time to use that information. I just love being your knight in shining armor. You can take your coat off. The heater is gonna kick in any minute. Okay, fine. Well, don't beg me to turn it off when you're sweating. But why did you say it like that? You didn't say you didn't want to take it off. You didn't just say no, you say you couldn't. W why? N no, I don't actually care, I just wanted to make conversation. Why would someone like me care about someone like you? <sighs> I've just... I've never seen you without long sleeves on. Whatever, sort of, I'm a little curious. Maybe if you were more interesting, we could talk about something else. Think, things you don't want people to see? Yeah, y you're not the only one. It's nothing. We're almost there. Are any of them because of me? 
I'm okay. Just answer the question. I see. We're we're here. You should go. Yeah, I'm fine. Just go already. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Wait. Just uh I know it's a lot to ask, but could I could I come in? I know it's late and I wanna go to sleep. But I really really need to tell you something. Thank you. Hasn't changed much since I was here last time. Are your parents home? Just wouldn't want to get you in trouble, that's all. Mind if I sit on your bed? Yeah, sit next to me. <sighs> okay. What I wanted to tell you... Um... Jeez, where do I even start? I don't hate you. I know my actions don't exactly line up with that statement, but just hear me out, please. Thanks. So, yeah, I, I don't hate you. Quite the opposite, actually. You see the best in people. You're optimistic, hopeful. You want things to always have the best outcome. And you try so, so hard to make things better for everyone. You're selfless. People walk on you, and you get right back up and do it all over again. I can't stand watching you get hurt, and I know, I know that I've hurt you, probably more than just about anybody else. I am, I know I'm a hypocrite, I know that I'm not worth the time you're giving me, or your forgiveness. But I only did what I did because I hoped you would finally protect yourself. I don't want to be a source of pain for you anymore. I don't want to hurt you. I don't want to be the reason that you... No, it, it's okay. You don't have to let go. Please, please don't let go. I don't deserve your kindness. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> no, you're definitely still an idiot. Especially for forgiving me and doing this. Yeah, I I meant that. I mean, I guess I just meant that. <sighs> don't don't make me say it. I I love you. I didn't think I'd ever get to hear you say that to me. I'm sorry I didn't try to apologize or explain myself sooner. Well, you may forgive me, but it's going to take a while for me to forgive myself. I should probably be going soon. I kept you up for long enough as it is. Are, are you sure? Okay, well... I'll stay then. I don't have anything on me, but I don't think I'll need pajamas for the night anyway. <laughs> You're saying this is your dream come true? Well, can you tell me what happened in that dream? You don't want to tell me? Well, how about we just start with this? 